If you guys are thinking about making a large purchase soon and you're planning on paying it back over an extended period of time on one of your credit cards, then you might want to consider getting the Navy Federal Platinum credit card. In this video, I'm going to be going over why you should get the Navy Federal Platinum credit card versus all of the other Navy Federal credit cards. If you're already subscribed, then welcome back. But if you guys are new to my channel, my name is Ish Sandiford and you are now watching Just Money where we talk about financial related topics such as personal and business credit, real estate, and other financial related topics. So if that's something you're into, then you're probably going to want to consider subscribing. But without further ado, let's get into today's video. Okay, so Navy Federal has five different types of unsecured credit cards that they offer, and some are gonna be better than others, depending on what you're trying to get out of them, of course. Some of their credit cards offer high reward points on specific purchases that you're making, and some of their other credit cards are gonna offer very enticing perks. But on this video, we're here to talk about the Navy Federal Platinum credit card and why you should consider getting it. So right off the bat, you'll notice that the Navy Federal Platinum credit card is the only credit card that Navy Federal offers that doesn't offer any reward points, while the other four Navy Federal unsecured credit cards do. Shoot, even the secure credit card that they offer gives you reward points on your purchases. And that secure credit card, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be known as the end reward secured credit card. This credit card is perfect for people who are trying to build or rebuild their credit. So if you guys have any more questions in regards to that and how this credit card works, then I made a full in-depth video. Feel free to browse my channel or hit the link in the description below if you guys would like to know more. But back to the Platinum credit card. The thing that makes the Platinum Navy Federal credit card so desirable than all of the other Navy Federal credit cards is this credit card can actually help save you money. Ish, what do you mean save you money? Can you explain? Yes, let me explain. But first, let's go over all the benefits that this credit card has to offer. So if you go to the Navy Federal website, you'll quickly notice that the interest rate on this credit card is actually lower than all of the other Navy Federal credit cards. And not only is the interest rate lower than all of the other Navy Federal credit cards out there, but it also has special perks that it offers. If you're new to having the Platinum card and you want to do a balance transfer from another credit card that is not a Navy Federal credit card, then you can do that. And you'll only pay 0.99% intro APR on the balance transfer that you just did. But the catch for this, it's only going to be at a 0.99% APR for the first 12 months from the day you did the balance transfer. So for a whole entire year, you're going to be at a crazy low interest rate. You're going to be paying little to nothing for borrowing X amount of dollars. But you do actually have to do this within 60 days of you opening the account. Now, if you decide to do a balance transfer after the 60 days, then you definitely still can do a balance transfer. And it's still going to be free to do a balance transfer, but you're going to be at a higher APR, of course. You'll probably be anywhere between 11.24% all the way up to 18% APR, but even that's not even that bad to be honest. I've seen plenty of other credit cards out there with an interest rate of like a 20% or even a 29%. In fact, if you go to the Navy Federal website, they have comparisons on there so they can show you you're actually getting a really good deal. So you low key still can't really complain about the 11.24% or even the 18% interest rate that you're getting from this credit card. But obviously, you would still want that 0.99% intro APR for obvious reasons. Navy Federal pretty much at this point isn't even really taxing you for those first 12 months. So if you guys have a credit card out there that's not a Navy Federal credit card and it has a balance, then you can definitely switch that balance onto this Navy Federal Platinum card as a strategic way to help you guys save money. Because let's say, for example, you owe $5,000 on another credit card. And not only do you owe $5,000, but let's say the interest rate on that credit card is like a 29% APR. Instead of paying the interest rate on that credit card every month for that amount of money that you're borrowing, you can open this Platinum credit card. And while you're opening it during the application process, they're going to ask you if you would like to do a balance transfer. Transfer. You would then type in the credit card information that you're trying to do the balance transfer on. And within a few business days, if you get approved, then the balance transfer will go through. Navy Federal will then pay off that balance with the Platinum card that you just opened. And now you literally took that balance and switched it to your Platinum credit card, which has a lower interest rate. So again, hypothetically speaking, if you have a 29% APR that you're paying every month, you are now going to go from a 29% to a 0.99% APR for those first 12 months. So that right there, ladies and gentlemen, is what I mean when I say the Platinum credit card can help save you guys money. And also, if you guys are finding any of this information helpful, if you guys could do me a favor and hit the like button, I would truly appreciate that because it really helps me out a lot. But anyways, just keep note, everybody, if you decide to use your Platinum credit card again after you do the balance transfer, then you're going to have to pay a regular APR, which is a variable of 11.24% all the way up to 18%. Because again, remember, you're only getting the 0.99% APR for the balance transfer that you did, not for any other future purchases. But the Platinum credit card is honestly an awesome card even if you're not trying to do a balance transfer and just want it to have as a low interest rate credit card. If you're thinking about buying something soon and you know that you're gradually going to be paying it over time, then definitely get a low interest rate credit card. I've seen credit cards out there to where some people might owe like $7,000 and they're paying over $100 just in interest rates every month. To whereas if you're in the same case scenario owing $7,000 on the platinum credit card, your interest rate could potentially be split in half. 
or even more than that. So if you're looking to do a balance transfer to help save you money, then I would definitely consider getting the Platinum credit card. And if you know that you're gonna be making a very large purchase soon and you already plan on making those payments every month, then this Platinum credit card might be the credit card for you. And if those two things already weren't good enough, the sweetest thing about Navy Federal is there are no balance transfer fees, no foreign transaction fees, no cash advance fees, and also no annual fees on none of their credit cards that they offer. Besides the flagship rewards credit card, that credit card has an annual fee of about $49 a year. Year. I actually got the flagship rewards credit card not too long ago and I am loving it. If you guys want more information in regards to the flagship rewards credit card then I made an entire video on that so feel free to browse my channel or hit the link in the description below. And real quick before I end this video I do want to mention that this credit card was actually mentioned by Go Banking Rates. And for those that don't know what Go Banking Rates is, it's pretty much a personal finance resource website that was designed to share articles about your advice on saving and managing your money. So even they found that the Platinum credit card was a really good deal. And also, you don't really need all that of a high credit score in order to get approved for this credit card. Ladies and gentlemen, you can have average credit and still get approved. But that pretty much wraps it up for today's video, guys. I really hope you guys found any value in this information. If you guys feel like you did, then please consider hitting the like button. And also, let me know in the comments below, are you looking to do a balance transfer or have you already done one? Let me know in the comments. I would like to know your experience on it. For me, personally, I got the Platinum credit card twice in order to do a balance transfer both times. So I myself am even doing this technique, so definitely take advantage while you can. But if you guys made it to the end of the video, then I truly do appreciate you guys. We're at 19,521 subscribers at the time of this recording. So I do appreciate all who watch. I do post weekly videos for those that don't know. And again, if you guys haven't already, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet already, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. So that way you guys get notified every time I ish post a new video. And again, we talk about personal and business credit, real estate, and other financial related topics. So if that's something you're into, then you're probably going to want to consider subscribing. We talk about how to get high limits on your credit cards. We talk about how to boost your personal credit. We talk about how to obtain business credit. We talk about real estate. We talk about mortgage loan products. So this is your one-stop shop. And for those that don't know, I am a licensed real estate agent, a realtor, and I'm also a licensed mortgage loan originator as well. So if you guys have any questions in regards to real estate, then all my information is in the description below. But thank you guys so much for watching. I do post weekly videos again, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.